Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, my name is Adam Akmal bin Usman and my teammate is Muhammad Amirul Fikri bin Muhammad Isham, Abdul Qayyum bin Abdul Wahab and Muhammad Afiq Daniel bin Amran. So today we're gonna present our <coughs> business plan. Uh, so for our company names is for a suspension service. <coughs> so first is executive summary. And here we have three things, which is problem, solution, and company aims. For problem, 4A suspension service is a leading player in the automotive service sector, <coughs> dedicated to meeting the increasing demand for specialized suspension service. Solution is 4A suspension service offers a comprehensive range of high quality suspension service. Our team of experienced professionals is committed to delivering excellence and customer satisfaction through a blend of cutting-edge technology, <coughs> a premium parts and customer-centric approach for company aims. For a suspension service aims to be a market leader synonymous with quality, satisfaction and innovation in suspension servicing. <coughs> Our growth strategy involves expanding service, forming strategic partnership, and establishing a strong presence in the automotive auto aftermarket. So next is purpose of business plan. First is objective is to provide as a guide to starting a new business for entrepreneurs by identifying the things that need to be done from the aspect of management, service, potential customers, and cost estimate. Second is expand knowledge on suspension to internship student. And third is improve productivity and generate a profitable and consistent income. For the purpose, first is to provide high quality service to customer. Second is to train yourself to do business from small to large scale. And third, is as reference material to convince young people of the ability to run a business. <clears throat> so next is company background. 4A suspension was established in 2010 by four friends namely Abdul Qayyum, Amirul, Fikri, Adam Akmal and Afiq Daniel. Their business partner and plan to establish a workshop that specialized in suspension system which is 4A suspension as the company name since their names all start with a capital E. <coughs> they are also have their own skills where Abdul is skilled in marketing, Mirul is skilled in renovation, Adam is skilled in management, and Afik is skilled in installation. The skills they have further strengthened for a suspension until now. For a suspension is also developed Bumi Putra company and has been with the Malaysian Automotive Workshop Association after three years of its establishment in 2013. For a suspension partner with the F Tune company as experienced suspension company and as an improvement for the suspension system that for a suspension provide. So here, as you can see, is our company's profile. There's company names is for a suspension address. We at Jalan Aluka Jalama, Duran Tunggal Melaka. As you can see our email, websites, phone number, fax number, form of business, type of business, and else. So next is vision and mission to our company. For a suspension service vision is to become a Bumi Putra Suspension Servicing Center that is known for its good work quality and plays a leading role in the field of automotive technology. For mission, we provide the best and highest quality suspension services and be able to satisf satisfy all customer needs. Act as an advisor to ensure that customers take care of their suspension well and in the right way. Produce responsible and dedicated employees while carrying out their duty. So here you can see our value proposition canvas. So, for product and service are related to the customer job, 
for example two years warranty for any product purchase and customer job they are just need to purchase the good that we sold so next is gain creator and it is related to the customer segment on the gain slot for example gain green creators comfort and it is related to gains vehicle look more beautiful and sporty third is value proposition pain reliever related to customer segment pains for example pain reliever ready stock product related with campaign customer segment more expenses from oem so next is rational prospection so our company located at uh, Lugaja and then for our facilities we have a waiting room with aircon and mini cafes uh, on uh, waiting room we have external easy access near car wash and main road Lugaja while the public transport close to public transport facilities next is physical position for a suspension is a suspension service center that cares about quality works and taking care of the customer many customers are satisfied with the result of their work and many times use the service offered by them for a suspension also provide advisory service for every customer who needs to service their vehicle suspension system for a suspension also provides a variety of high quality and well-known absorber option so here you can see owners worker profiles and qualification for Amiro Fikri as a company owner the qualification is bachelor degree for manager Adam Sakman and Osman which is, the qualification is bachelor degree and for supervisor is Abdul Kohim and Abdul Wahab the qualification is bachelor degree and for four men Muhammad Afik Daniel bin Amran the qualification is bachelor degree hi assalamualaikum and good morning i am Muhammad Amir Fikri bin Muhammad Isham and today i will present about the marketing plan okay the first one is good and service to effectively market our suspension service we will implement a comprehensive plan that leverages both digital and traditional channels to reach our target audience. Social media platform will be utilized to engage with potential customers sharing informative content about suspension system and showcasing before and after success stories. Traditional marketing channels such as local print publication and radio web will be employed to capture a diverse audience Particip participating in communities event car show and sponsoring local sport team will enhance brand visibility the second one is target market customer the customer main target market is the local population living in the area and vehicle user the location chosen is very strategic in terms of automotive suspension service workshop that are close to residential housing area. Our business not only focus on a man vehicle problem but also women vehicle owner are also low to do business with us. Uh, next market size. The first one is Increase brand visibility. Brand brand visibility. The strategy, which is digital marketing, implement implement SEO to improve online visibility. Utilize target online advertising. Tactic optimize website content for relevant keyword. Launch online ad campaign on Google and social media platform. Timeline one one two three one. Key performance indicator, which is website traffic, search engine ranking, and ad and ad impression. Second one is target content creation. Develop informative content through blog, video, and social media. The tactic is create blog posts addressing suspicion facts. Produce engaged video showcase suspicion expertise. Share content on social media platform. The timeline is on ongoing. 
the key performance uh, content engagement social share website traffic okay, the third one is customer referral program the strategy will launch a customer ref referral program offering discount or incentive okay, the third thing, develop referral program with clear benefit for existing customer who refer new client promote the program through various channels the timeline is two month month two okay the key performance indicator which is number of reference conversation rate okay the fourth local collaboration partner with local automotive influencer and event okay the tactic identify the identify and approach influencer for collaboration so sponsor or sponsor or participate in local car related event the timeline month 3 to 6 the key performance impress at event influencer engagement data analysis and refinement regular monitor KPIs and adjust strategies accordingly the tactic implement analytic tool to track website performance at effectiveness and customer engagement analyze data monthly and refine strategy the timeline is ongoing and the and the KPI metric improvement cost per acquisition okay next Uh, company market segment we conduct a detailed segmentation analysis to identify this distinct customer profile based on factors such as vehicle type driving habit and geographical location we craft tailored marketing message that resonate with each with each segment in passing emphasizing the specific benefit our suspension service offer to address their unique requirement regular customer feedback mechanism will ensure ongoing refinement of our strategies allowing us to maintain a dynamic and customer centric approach with our market segment for suspension service competitor it is very important for for a suspension service to know who the competitor are and what they have to offer which can help for a suspension service highlight company product service and marketing there are so many workshops that offer the same service but for a suspension service is trying to achieve customer satisfaction by giving the best quality of service fast and with reasonable service charge. Okay, the market size. Our marketing plan will concentrate on both competitive price and service quality distinction in order to gain a significant market share in the suspension service sector. In order to highlight our knowledge, we will fund employee training on newer suspension technologies and aggressively present our skill through eye-catching case studies and client industries to enhance our market posi position and attract wider audience we want to implement a customer loyalty program and broaden our service range with complementary service okay, next marketing mix 4 p as product comprehensive diagnosis maintenance repair and performance improvement service will all be part of our suspension service offering the second one is focusing on diverse vehicle type and client requirement we will highlight our proficiency in managing a range of suspension system. 
emphasis specializes service including routine maintenance package for daily driver and specially tuning for performance fanatic okay price our pricing strategy will be competitive reflecting the value of our service while considering market standard second one is offer transparent pricing structure providing detailed estimate for different service to build trust with our customer promotional pricing for bundle service and loyalty program will be introduced to encourage repeat business customer retention okay this is the little bit about our price pricing Place. We will carefully choose location for our service facilities that have a lot of automobile traffic and visibility to improve accessibility. An online center for information, scheduling and service inquiry will be provided by an easy to use and intuitive website. Our reach will be increased by partnership with Near, near nearby auto dealership and part stop which will make our service more convenient and available to a wider range of clients okay, promotion social media platform will be used to engage content customer testimony and targeted advertising collaboration with automotive influencer and party C in local event will also contribute to brand visibility and community engagement. Okay, sale forecasting. In 2023, the sale profit is as much as uh, 1 million and 18,000 ringgit and is expected to increase by 10% in 2024 which is a profit of 1,188,000 okay, in 2025 our profit is expected to increase by 15% equal to 1,366,000 and in 2000 and the expected profit in 2026 will increase by 20% percent which is 1639,4400 in the fifth year which is the year 200 okay in the fifth year which is the year of 2027 we expect there to be an increase of 23 23% equal to 7 million 290,151 ringgit and expected profit for the next year is much as seven million two hundred nineteen ninety thousand one hundred and fifty one ringgit equal equivalent to fifteen fifty eight percent yes this is the expectation for sale forecasting okay operation plan the process of creating and justify a really yearly operate budget proposal is determine the operation and budget for each division of the company for the following two months Process flow chart from beginning to conclusion such as company location and our 
raw material and operational budget uh, include in operational is cover the key prof process resource and activity required to deliver our product service efficiently while maintaining the highest quality standard our operation our operational plan is designed to provide a detailed roadmap for the day to day functioning uh, of a for suspension for a suspension okay equipment um, this is the equipment which is uh, we have in our company okay the first one is computer which is the price is 2500 and the second one is website cost stationery portal state and printer air conditioner table heating table television sofa hand tool absorber spring clamp hydraulic jack cast jack stand swan air compressor 3 horsepower Okay, that's all for me. We move to the next. Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Abdul Qayyim Abdul Wahab. Okay, so I will present about uh, material planning for manufacturing process, inventory planning. Okay, okay. So for uh, so for the first one, uh, stock rack, stock rack. Uh, the price uh is three thousand three hundred, and uh for the unit uh sixteen unit. And total cost uh, 4800 Okay, table uh, only one unit and uh, the price 150 and total cost 150 Okay, for the chair, uh, one unit only uh, and price 50 and for total cost uh, 50 ringgit. Okay, uh, so computer and the last one computer. Uh, the price is 1500 and you need only one and total cost 1500 so total cost for material planning is 6500 okay uh, next i want to explain about capacity planning okay uh, so uh, this is suspension brand okay for the first one uh, is f tune F tune uh, the price is three thousand and uh, you need fifteen and total cost for F tune uh, is forty five thousand. Okay for KYB uh, is twenty five unit and one unit uh, is one thousand five hundred. So total cost is thirty seven thousand five hundred. Okay so uh, next uh, gap. Yep, the price is 1300 and you need uh, 20 and so total cost 26000 Okay, for KHS, uh, you need 15 and each unit is uh, 2000 and total cost for KHS is 30000 Okay, uh, suspension brand for greedy Okay, greedy. The price is one thousand five hundred, and you need ten, and total cost for greedy is fifteen thousand. Uh, so for Skyjacker, suspension brand, uh, you need three. Uh, per unit is uh, the price is five thousand, and total cost for Skyjacker is fifteen thousand. Okay, and the last one for KW suspension, uh, per unit. Uh, is 4000 but we buy 5 unit and the total cost for KW suspension is 20000 okay so uh, total suspension brand is 188500 ringgit okay uh, next i will explain about process flow okay so for the first one uh, customer wine customer walk in uh, into the to the shop and then uh, for men inspect the vehicle 
after walk-in uh, for when inspect the vehicle okay after inspect after inspect uh, for when uh, recommend best suspension uh, recommend best suspension to customer and then uh, customer must decide the suspension anything suspension what anything suspension if customer want uh, for men can install it okay so the next uh, for men uh, install installation installation process so uh, after installation process uh, fitting process okay so after fitting process uh, for men uh, do test drive okay if uh, anything happen to uh, suspension for men can repair again so after after suspension okay uh, customer must and and do appointment set for next service so next I will explain about layout plan okay by strategically placing components such as work up equipment store office and customer waiting room the layout plan aims to create a harmonious and functional environment that aligns with the intended purpose of the space. The layout plan serves as a guide for effective utilization of the available area, promoting stimulus work workflows and ensuring an optimal user experience. Okay, so uh, this is organization aspect. So for organization structure, okay, the first one, the height of the company, uh, so company owner and under company owner is manager. Uh, so under manager is supervisor and mechanic. So under mechanic, uh, uh, technician one, technician two, the last one, technician three. Okay, next I will explain about list of workers. Okay, four uh, position. Okay, the first one is owner. Uh, monthly salary owner is fifteen thousand, and after uh, cut EPF thirteen percent, uh, one hundred nineteen, one thousand nineteen hundred fifty, and so the total uh, month monthly salary owner is thirteen thousand fifty ringgit. Okay, for manager, uh, monthly salary is ten thousand, and after cut EPF thirteen percent, uh, one hundred, one thousand three hundred. Okay, so total uh, of total monthly salary for manager is eight thousand seven hundred. So, uh, position for supervisor, uh, the monthly salary for supervisor is eight thousand. Uh, EPF 13% so uh, 1,040 ringgit so total monthly salary for supervisor is 6,960 okay, for mechanic uh, the monthly salary is 6,000 and EPF 13% so 780 and total for monthly salary mechanic is 5,200 Okay, the last one for technician mechanic. Uh, is three technician, so monthly salary is nine thousand. So uh, thirteen percent for EPF, so one hundred, one thousand, one hundred seventy. So uh, total for technician mechanic, three technician mechanic is seven thousand eight hundred thirty. Okay, so total for monthly salary workers uh, is 48,000 for EPF 13% uh, is 6,240 and total for list of workers uh, 41,000 
760. Next, uh, job scope. So, job scope for position business owner. Okay, responsibility is uh, ensure that all management runs smoothly. Uh, next, take care of all employee welfare. Last one, manage and sign the project that has been prepared. Okay, for manager job scope, uh, first one, ensure that every operation that takes place in the workspace runs smoothly. Uh, second, inform the business owner that there will be a shortage of workshop supplies. And last one, report every accident to the general manager and uh, record every vehicle that comes for service. Okay, job scope for supervisor. Uh, the first one, preparing, supervising and controlling workshop activities. Uh, second one, reviewing maintenance work and recommending improvements. Uh, third, report every problem that occurs in the workspace to the manager. The last one, managing workshop staff. Okay, for position mechanic, job scope. Job scope is uh, be the head of the workspace at the service center. Second, ensure every mechanic does their job. Uh, third, report every problem that occurs, occurs in the workspace to the supervisor. The last one, take care of the welfare of every available mechanic. Okay, for the last one, technician mechanic, uh, job scope is do all the tasks that has been given. Uh, satisfying the needs of customers who come to the service center. Uh, and uh, report every incident that happens in the workspace to the available foreman. So, uh, last one, complete the task within time given. Okay, uh, so next, uh, I will explain about financial plan. Okay, so financial plan. Uh, the first one, uh, project implementation cost. So, uh, the first one, item. Item for office furniture. So office furniture, uh, total we buy uh, office furniture is $15,700. Uh, this own money. Uh, so own money is 15700 And the second, machinery, machinery and tools. Okay, total for machinery and tools is $18,480. Uh, but we loan uh, 11,500 so own money uh, is 6,980 okay, so sec uh, second item working capitals so for marketing uh, total 1,500 own money 1,500 so next administrative uh, total 48,000 and own money only own money 48,000 and stop uh, 188,500 ringgit uh, and we loan 188,500 so uh, no own money so the third one uh, the third uh, is other expenditure so for renovation uh, total 2,000 uh, on money 2,000 and next uh, utilities and rent total for on money 3000 uh, so next insurance uh, total for on money 3500 okay so additional uh, next additional last one additional uh, contingency cost 10% grand total so on money uh, 28068 ringgit okay so total for project implementation cost uh, the item is 100 1748 ringgit Hello My name is Muhammad Afiq and I will continue our present So my topic first is a uh, fixed asset setup cost pre operating cost and initial cost for a uh, first month Okay the item uh, for the set the FE asset is a uh, first office equipment Utilities, rent, insurance, marketing, tools and machinery, and renovation. So, in this uh, fixed asset equipment uh, for office equipment and utilities is uh, under fixed asset. Rent, 
uh, initial cost, insurance, in setup cost, marketing, in pre-operating cost, tools and machinery in fixed asset, and renovation in setup cost. So the total for uh, fixed asset, setup cost, and pre-operating cost is 44,118. So in first month cost, first uh, asset and initial cost is 108 and 7,000, 108, 748,000, and bank loan is uh, 200,000. So the total is uh, 308,700. 48,000 Okay, the second is a uh, working capital For in this table, we can see the working capital is in uh, Marketing expense, promotion, office expense, office supplies, insurance costs, salaries, utilities and rent And the total of uh, working capital is 80,700 ringgit So, uh, the next one is uh, working capital in working capital, uh, first, uh, fixed asset initial cost that uh, 44,118 and second is uh, working capital uh, 80,700 so the total is 144,818 and the last one is unexpected expenditure or contingency that uh, uh, to 28,016 68 so the total is uh, 152,948,000 okay. The capital uh, we have uh, from own money that is uh, 108,748 and loan 200,000 So the total uh, our capital is uh, 308,748,000 So uh, the next one is project implementation cost uh, first, Muhammad Fikri, uh, our shareholder, Adam Akmal, Abdul Qayyum, and me, Muhammad Afiq. So, the total, uh, the contribution of shareholder uh, source, we can get uh, 108,000. So, the next one is loan amortization and depreciation value. So, the total, total loan is uh, 200. Okay, interest rate uh, 10% and payback year is 1 year So uh, based on table This is uh, our period year interest principal and current balance From uh, first month to month 12 So the total uh, based on table We can totally monthly repayment uh, a month is 16,666 ringgit so this uh, depreciation. So uh, asset name is stock. The purchase cost is 188,500 and last spend is five years. So we can see in this table for years, uh, first years to fifth years. Okay, so this table is uh, based on pro forma cash flow statement from uh, January until December 2020. So you can see the table, uh, cash flow and cash outflow. So and the total. Okay, the next one is a uh, profit and loss statement per year. So uh, profit and loss statement first in sale, uh, three hundred thousand and cost of stock is one hundred eighty-eight five hundred thousand. So the gross profit is one hundred and eleven five hundred ringgit. So next one is expand expand uh, in salary, rental, utilities, and business registration and lodging cost. That's a total of fifty two thousand five hundred. That's on salary forty eight thousand. Rental two thousand. Utilities one thousand. And business registration is one hundred and one thousand five hundred ringgit. So in this table is a profit and loss statement. So you can see the performa balance sheet from a uh, asset it, that is cash, insurance, equipment, and machine and tools that are debit and credit. Uh, this one is liabilities, loan, and equity uh, on the capital, material, accountant payable, rent, utilities, wage, and renovation. So the total is uh, three hundred twenty-one thousand six hundred and eighteen.